Hi everyone, and thanks for joining me for day 20 of the Holy Heroes devotional. Today's devotion is inspired by Spider-Man. Spider-Man Homecoming picks up right where Captain America Civil War left off. Peter Parker feels special because he was chosen by Tony Stark, given this fancy new Spider-Man suit, and invited to help the Avengers settle their internal conflict. In the wake of those high-profile events, however, Peter occupies himself with some much lower-profile acts of heroism. He thwarts a thief trying to steal a bicycle. He bungles an attempt to stop an ATM burglary. He even stops to give directions to an elderly woman lost in Queens. All the while, though, Peter feels called to bigger and better things, as if those smaller acts of heroism were insignificant. He anxiously awaits a call from Tony to join the big leagues, and he leaves repeated messages on Happy Hogan's voicemail. I feel like I could be doing more, Peter complains. I'm just curious when my next real mission is going to be. Surely Peter Parker isn't the only one to feel insignificant, as if the, the little things we do don't really matter. As a, a pastor for a small rural church, I can certainly relate. You know, when I, I hear stories of rapidly growing congregations or visit some mega church, it's easy to feel like my small ministry is insignificant or unsatisfying. And perhaps you feel the same way about your spiritual service or about your career, or maybe just your lot in life. The truth is, though, the little things we do really do matter. Jesus once said in Luke chapter 16, verse 10, If you are faithful in little things, you will be faithful in large ones. In other words, God sees the little things that we do, and that influences his decision about whether or not to, to give us greater responsibilities. And Jesus also once compared the kingdom of heaven in Mark chapter 4 to a mustard seed, which is the smallest of all seeds. Yet when planted, it grows and becomes the largest of all garden plants with such big branches that the birds can perch in its shade. Big things often start very small. By the end of the movie, Peter gets his wish. Tony Stark offers him a, a brand new high-tech Spider-Man costume and a place on the Avengers roster. By this time, however, Peter realized that the little things he does really do make a big difference. He tells Tony, I'm good. I'd rather just stay on the ground for a little while. Just a friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Somebody's got to look after the little guy, right? Like Peter, I believe that God wants each of us to bloom where we're planted, so to speak. Rather than coveting a, a bigger or better place or position in life, we need to be faithful in the little things. Even if your life doesn't seem grand or glorious, what you do matters because it matters to God. Let's pray together. Lord God, I admit that I sometimes feel like I could be doing bigger and better things, as though the, the role you've given me isn't very significant in the grand scheme of things. But I also realize that the little things really do matter. Help me to be faithful in the small stuff and content in my calling. Amen. Thank you for joining me uh, again for today's devotional. If you'd like to continue to follow along, we've got 10 more days of devotionals ahead of us. So just hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. In the meantime, God bless and be a hero.